Uh, the last six months been pretty hectic, um, real busy, busy year this year. Um, you know, coming from high school, um, never thought it would be this busy and you know, actually being in the environment and everything, it's pretty buzzing to, um, to be with the All Black Sevens and doing all the travelling and footy and yeah, it's been um, crazy but man, I wouldn't um, have any other way. Coming from school and you know, when you think about it, Sevens here and the pace now, it's way, way faster than school, schoolboy footy. But you know, I, I still enjoy schoolboy footy and man, when I was there, I thought it was quick as well. So you know, it's just another level actually, um, to be honest. So, yeah. When I see my cousin, uh, Tim and I Williams play, um, play for Sevens, that's when um, I changed my thought and I was like, I heard up my dad and I was like, I want to have a jam with um, Sevens ever since I seen him play in the jersey and play Sevens and you know, from then on that just changed my mind and you know, that's when I think I fell in love with um, Rugby Sevens and um, I think he knows that as well and I told him that um, you know, if it wasn't for him I wouldn't have been playing, playing Sevens and my dad as well. So. There's the first step. It says to McFarlane, we'll see you later, and there's the second. And here is Nanai Satudo. Passed on the other occasion, passes on this occasion, and Big Joe says thank you. Nanai Satudo will step, and he'll race away. You're not going to catch him. 18 years young, he's gone. I've been to Vegas, Vancouver, uh, Singapore, and now I'm in London. Uh, you know, when I was in school and I was playing footy, I've always wanted to travel the world. Always told mom and dad, oh, I want to be a rugby player because I, ju I just want to travel the world and you know see all different um, parts of the parts of the world. And um, now it's been pretty crazy, and sometimes I still pinch myself now and then. But uh, favorite city would probably be uh, Vancouver, just because of the snow. I've never been in the snow before, and um, you know, went up the snow with um, with some of the boys, and I you know, loved the my highlight with all black sevens probably con games. Um, no, there's not, uh, not much you can say about that. Bringing, bringing home the gold medal, and it was a surreal feeling, and something something I'll cherish forever. And um, you know, when I got caught up, got the late call up, you know, I just gave him my all, and just wanted to make my mom and dad proud. And yeah, it's something I'll, like I said before, just something I'll cherish forever. It's a proud moment. Uh, every time I wear that black jersey, and um, when they see me on um, on TV. You know, they, I get messages from mom, especially, oh, especially from mom, um, wishing me luck um, for every tourney and um, um, having a safe flight every um, every place I go to, and it's just something um, like I said before, I won't take for granted.